What's going on guys and in today's video I'm going to be talking about why you can't land your first client with the short form content offer right so I've been getting a lot of feedback when it comes to some of the clients that I serve when it comes to crafting their short form content offer there seems to be a big blind spot when it comes to how exactly you go about offering this to your clients because a lot of agency owners or want to be agency owners offer an editing service for their clients when in fact why would somebody buy editing from you when they could simply outsource their services right so what you need to be selling when it comes to the short form content offer is not editing but instead you need to be selling you need to be selling attention right attention is going to pivot your offer from a simple $1,000 service, one-off service to a retention offer, right? You need to pitch ROI. For example, if a client has a, if a client has a $500 course, right? You're going to take that $500 course, right? Your course is $500. So what exactly does this mean to the client? If you're able to produce short form content video for them, for example, one short form content video, we could assume that one short form content video equals about 500 to 1000 views, right? So what does that mean for the client? It means potential leads. You need to be talking in terms of acquisition. How does it translate directly to acquisition? All right, so 500 to 1000 views in each short form content video out of a $500 course, right? So out of 50, out of 500 to 1,000, let's say only 5% of those YouTube, of those viewers actually want to click on your call to action, right? That's going to be call to action, meaning you drive them to a course, you drive them to a, a Facebook group, you drive them to a webinar funnel, whatever that case might be. That's gonna be 50 to 100 qualified leads per short content, short form content video potential, right? Let's say only, let's give a rough estimate that only 50% of those leads are actually gonna want to do anything, right? Maybe say, let's say, okay, you got 50 to 100 leads, right? But maybe they're not fully qualified, right? Maybe they can't afford your service, etc. So let's say 50% of those, right, rough estimates, can actually afford your service. So out of 50 to 100, right? That's gonna be 25 to 50 qualified leads potential per video, right? Let's say only 5% of those, let's say only 10% of those want to convert. That's gonna be five to 10 calls per video. And that's how you need to pivot your offer. You need to pivot your offer in a way that it's gonna be a no brainer offer for these coaches and consultants or whoever you're targeting. You need to pitch it in a way that shows the money, right? A lot of this ROI in terms of short form content production isn't directly seen right away. So we need to actually implement the offer in these people and in these potential clients' heads as money right we they need to see they need to see the actual roi before it's even there right so again 500 dollars course one to one video that's say anywhere from 500 to 2000 views organically because that's about how much these videos get five percent of those click on the call to action that's 50 to 10 50 to 100 leads per day five percent of those i mean Let's say 50% of those are actually qualified. That's 25 to 50 qualified leads. Let's say only 55 to 10 of those convert, right? Meaning they book a call, right? Meaning they actually buy the, buy the course again. So out of 500, out of five, going back to the price of the course, five, five, 10, 15, 20, 25, that's gonna be 250 to 5K in potential recurring revenue. Right? This is how you need to switch your offer. This is how you need to pivot your offer in terms of showing ROI for each and every single call that you go to. People are not gonna purchase from you if they don't see direct ROI. 
So you need to pivot your offer in a way that shows them that, hey, this is going to be a potential to bring inbound leads, right? So again, again, you're essentially selling attention, right? You're essentially selling attention, right? But you need to find a way to pivot that attention into what exactly it means in dollar amount. Don't just pitch attention. Don't just pitch virality. Pitch what virality brings. You got it, guys? So thank you guys for watching this video. If you want to learn more about how to start a short-form content agency, how to pivot your agency to the next level, you can go ahead and learn more down below, or you can join our free Facebook group where we drop free value bombs every single week. Thank you guys for watching again. Catch you guys next time.